Good evening, welcome to my Monday training session here at Start Building Me. Welcome. It's my nightly training session to prove to you that consistency is more important than intensity and duration of your training. You just got to do a little bit every day. And by a little bit, I mean a real little bit, folks, because I can't be bothered tonight. I am tired as all hell. I went on a massive mountain bike ride, not yesterday, the day before, and it's still weighing on my soul, crushing me down. I walk the dogs, it's boiling hot, and I think I need to drink more tea and go back to bed. So that's my plan. Rest up tonight, rest up tomorrow, because it's going to be semi-final action at the FIFA World Cup on Wednesday morning here in Australia whenever time that is few around the world so like and subscribe if you haven't already and check me out from time to time if you want a basic workout that's efficient highly effective and free first and foremost so without further ado let's get going because i am going to get going out of here within 15 minutes to prove how effective this stuff can do can be so excuse me I'll walk and talk well, is this, folks, I'm sitting down on something, I'm standing back up, it's called exercise. It's called a squat in particular, an unweighted squat. So without knowing anything, I've hopefully wore shorts that I'm not going to split tonight, that's not too bad. You can sit down on your chair, just say you're at your office typing or something, and you want to have a quick break, you want to get the blood pumping through your body, why would you do this? Because it pumps the blood through to your brain and your brain needs blood folks oxygenated blood so you stand up off your desk maybe turn your body from side to side sit back down stand back up this is the basics of a um, squat in and out burger 15 minutes that's right but that's like the underlying concept of this as well is we've all got stuff to do and if you want to go do more than that, then you can do more than that, as you know, Sally Star Jump. But the whole point is just to get the blood pumping, get yourself breathing, and that's really all you need to do. Now, muscle conditioning, sure, you've got to do more. You've got to start focusing on your diet, but that's not what Start Building Me is about. Start Building Me is about breathing, getting the blood pumping, raising that heart rate, raising that blood pressure, letting it sink back down, and then getting on to whatever it is that you're doing. I'm guessing Sally Star Jump is going to be cleaning up the house still. Hopefully you got that done. If not, um, make the chublet do it. Anyway, let's bust out a few squats, bust out a few push-ups, and uh, yeah, like I said, I downloaded the Family Guy Simpsons, I'm watching Yellowstone, and uh, what else? That's about it, folks. That's about my brain power for a Monday at the moment. Keith is letting the neighborhood know who's boss. Got to love him. From the side perspective here, sitting back into my heels with the old preacher position. You can have your arms out like this as well, folks, to stop yourself falling backwards as a counterbalance. Yeah, I got it done. Nice one. Yeah, I'm sure if you just sat there watching watching uh, Wizard of Oz. So, weight goes to the outside of your feet. That's why we have arches in our feet. Drill your toes into the ground, sitting back into your heels, and that's what a squat looks like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and shake it off like Taylor Swift showing your age that song's probably 10 years old now and like I always say folks if you come here to train or not breathe that's the main important part switch off the news switch off the idiots that are talking gibberish into your ears and just focus on the one thing important and hey that's you ignore all the people who say it's all about society it's just as much about you folks you've got to make sure that you're useful to society by looking after yourself so without further ado squat with me <sighs> three four five six seven eight nine 
10 and 20 out of the way. I'm gonna do 50 and 50 of each and get back out to my swag position on the floor. I might have some, some Tums or some antacids for indigestion. And yeah, I reckon I'll get a pretty early, hey, hey Jazz, SI is always good to see you in the house. Get that heart rate up, get your blood pumping through your body and onto bigger and better things, hopefully. I, I'm so tired tonight, I'm not even gonna make dinner. I couldn't be bothered. <laughs> not even gonna make a protein shake or anything. I'm just gonna go lie down, cold peppermint tea and pass out. Another 10, don't forget, keep on breathing. <sighs> ah, it's still free for the time being until carbon trapping, tracking apps come in and jackbooted thugs come and put their boot on our necks. Late night football, yeah, it's catching up on me. <laughs> it's the semi-finals, so not tomorrow morning, but the morning after. So I'm gonna have a nice proper night's sleep tonight um, because the following two nights afterwards are semi-finals and then the final, um, the finals on Sunday, so Monday morning for us. And I think the third round playoff, the thanks for coming trophy is, uh, I guess Saturday night maybe, or Friday, no, probably Saturday night. Sitting back into your heels, weight to the outside of your feet. Make sure of that, folks, and breathe. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. As you can see, I'm not sitting on the box. I'm just using it as a depth gauge to... Uh, for your butt to touch against, and you don't have to go deeper than that. Oh, it's cool, I put the air conditioner in here a little bit earlier, so it's not as sweaty as it normally is, which is decent. Did a little bit of gardening, I didn't do the mowing today because I couldn't be bothered, but that's catching, catching up. Getting some ridiculously high lawn, you gotta, at this time of year in the tropics, you have to do the lawn mowing sometimes twice a week, else it just gets too long. So haven't done it since I think Thursday, Wednesday. So there you go, almost almost a week. So anyway, shake out your legs. Make sure you're not getting any tension up in there. Another 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Supporting yourself, your own weight under gravity, folks. That's what it's all about. Should be something that you should be able to do quite effortlessly. And if you can't, it's not too late, but it's something you need to master to consider yourself having uh, decent control and coordination over your body, I believe. Uh, I think you really should be able to support yourself under gravity. I'm not gonna go as far to say chin-ups, but push-ups and squats most certainly. And it's something, it's an easy benchmark to work, for, work towards, you know? Yeah, I know it's ridiculous up here, but it's nice, it's nice to have nice grass. <laughs> but it's, uh, it's pretty savage. It's just good for the lads, sit outside with the lads and throw the Kong around for Keith. So it's pretty cool. But it's uh, the biggest pain in the rear end is when it's raining really heavily through sort of now, basically until March in the wet season. Sometimes you have to rain when it's like really muddy or even raining outside. So you're pushing the lawnmower through it and you just got these two brown tracks where the, <laughs> you just bog down in the mud so you cut the lawn sure it makes the whole yard look completely wrecked uh, do a few more 10 don't forget sitting back into your heels breathe as much as you can in between the repetitions will enable you to do more reps and the weight's going to the outside of your fo feet folks so your knees don't do that basically knees go your feet, the weight rather, goes to the outside of your feet like this, so you don't mess up your knees. Might not be a problem initially, but over a few years you'll damage the meniscus, a hard, hard tissue or hard ligament, 
Uh, sorry, yeah, hard tissue in between your knees. Anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna do ten more, do some push ups, and we'll be done. Ten minutes on the clock, folks. That's my whole point. <sighs> this is better than going for a walk, much more time efficient. You get much more done in the time, so. Um, that's what efficiency is all about, folks. And breathe. Take the time off between. And breathe. The best thing you can do to your body, other than drink water and sleep, is breathe. And as you well know, it is essential for life, like drinking water and sleeping as well. But the frequency of breathing is considerably more important. <laughs> so do it, folks. Like the Nike slogan. I've got my jean shorts as well where the pockets are hanging out. Anyway, they're better than my other new shorts that feel like uh, they're about to split when I'm doing these squats. 10 more to give me 50. I'm doing my 50 and 50 and 50 chin-ups during the day, which of course I did not do today. And then, like I said, I've had an idle day. So 10 more, let's get some push-ups out and breathe. If you can't do as many reps as me, it's probably because you're not breathing as much. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Squatting out of the way. Let's go down to the floor cam. And do some push-ups. So folks, if you can't do push-ups strictly, you can do them off your knees like that. Never forget that you are pushing yourself up off of the floor. Even if you are on your knees, don't listen to the sticklers. Some people have strong upper bodies and some people don't. You can condition your body to be strong. Until then, push up off your knees and don't worry about what people say. But for me, who has been doing push ups since a young lad, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, like this, tense your butt, dig your, f uh, your toes into the ground, spread your fingers like this, it'll give you a stable platform and will make you able to do more push ups. And breathe in between as always, folks. Breathe and take a load off. Kangaroo court style, as I always say, in between. Reading today, a character was crying for he said he needs to breathe. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> oh, it's, it's, again, it's like she needs to say, he needs to calm down. <laughs> Mum's upset. Anyway. Yeah, but speaking of a mum's upset, <laughs> those pictures you sent me today were quality. Good goodness. I can't wait to go to sleep, folks. I never care. I never, I'm never tired like this. It's wild. I'm going to make sure I keep mountain bike riding. Nothing flattens a battery more. Tense your butt, spread your fingers. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fight gravity, folks. Gravity is fighting you every day. If you don't do these exercises, you end up going back into the fetal position. We're trying to open ourselves up as is the way to make sure that you don't go fetal again and do damage. <sighs> and breathe. And look, I feel myself perspiring. It means it's working. I mean, I perspire when I walk outside, but it's a little bit different in 70% relative humidity and mid 30 degree Celsius. So I'm in here currently at the moment. Uh, it's about 24 degrees Celsius with the air conditioning on and obviously low relative humidity, but I'm perspiring. As you can see, I'm short of breath. I'm having to breathe. These are all good things, folks. We are not training to look like a himbo or a bimbo, as I always say. We're training 
to get our brain optimum, <laughs> our, our brain's optimum performance. Follow what I say, it's sort of not what I do. It's the end of the day, give me a break. You have to exercise, folks, the duality of body and mind. I don't care what people tell you. There's so many studies that show that you are far more uh, efficient, your body's functions are far more efficient with exercise. Your brain function is far more efficient with exercise. Um, it doesn't have to be, like I said, to the point of looking like a gym rat. I'm gonna be just fine. Be rain, yeah, well, it's pretty damn humid at the moment, but it's that time of year. Remember, dig in your toes, look up, spread your fingers, tense the butt, and breathe. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's where you get your st core stability out, folks. 16 minutes on the clock because I've been, what do they, what do they say, flapping my jaw. That's just the way it goes, folks. I had a sugar-free monster energy drink at three o'clock and I feel quite ghastly. Can only imagine what, how I'd feel like if I had the one that has 60 grams of sugar in it. Absolutely insane. Absolutely insane that that isn't tax. It should be like the UK. <laughs> Spread your fingers, tense your butt. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And the irony is, is that this monster energy drink, no sugar, and I still feel like I'm about to pass out. I'm so tired. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm a okay. I'm all about the alertness in the fitness industry, bros. Not quite. All right, I'm going to bust out 10 more. And as I always say, folks, don't match me. We're trying to compete with ourselves in our performance yesterday, which is quite easy for me because I did absolutely nothing yesterday apart from, I think, 17 chin-ups I've got up on my board. Felt pretty good with that. Usually that's like one set and I do multiple sets over the day. I didn't do any multiples. I did 17 reps and then called it quits. Didn't get in my cold tank, was way too energy drink zero, right in the sun, yeah, man. Haven't, uh, haven't been in good form at the moment. So without further ado, like and subscribe if you're re-watching this on the stream and wherever you are in the world, I hope you have a good day. Get outside, switch off the TV, radio, get off Twitter and social media. It's the devil. If you don't believe in the devil, believe in the fact that it's toxic. Give me 10 and let's get out of here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. That's a solid workout, folks. Whatever they say, don't believe them. Listen to Dave, eat your vitamins, believe in, what does it say, believe in God, and uh, believe in the 